terms of we, we, we met with Mr. Hogan this morning um, in London, um, I, some people would be surprised that he's still around um, when he first came in. Oh, it's, it's Hogan, he's only in it for himself, he's only, you know, he's, he's only going to be there for a wet weekend and, and then he'll be off, you know, over the horizon. That's not been the case, has it? He's been around for a little bit longer than most people expected. Yeah, think. you know, I, I think he, he's like me. I think that he l likes this brand, he likes the company. He likes the potential because there's so much room for growth. And, you know, uh, I, I think he, he loves the guys that we're working with. And to be quite honest, I think I talked about this last year too, the nostalgia of, of pro wrestling and, and what it, it brings. And, and some of the, 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 the guys like Hulk Hogan's generation, which was the generation before mine. Uh, that's why it, wrestling fans just don't want to see Hulk Hogan just disappear or go away or retire. I mean, you know, he's like a, um, you, can't, you can't take Pele and put him in the soccer game anymore. You, you know, maybe in a video game or something, but I mean, Hulk Hogan is still walking and entering the ring and, you know, doing his stuff, you know, and wrestling fans love it.